I'm going to take the remainder of this piece of wood off of this fretboard. And <clears throat> to do that, I've grabbed my little wood chisel. Um, gave it just a little bit, took the burr off, cleaned it up. I've also grabbed a old putty knife that's really sharp and thin on the end. Um, I've got a few other tools, a very small brass headed hand hammer that was kind of made. I'm actually not 100% sure, but um, small little dowel, something I picked up from my stepdad after he passed and uh, a not very sharp small chisel, but I can really get in there and get, tap it if I have to. Haven't had to use this one yet. Also, I'm using this little Harbor Freight saw, sticking it in here and, and sawing away as if I was putting in frets. I've used this to, to make frets before. And uh, I just did it to this section here then I stick this blade in, peel out some of the wood. There goes that piece and that piece. And then that gives me a little bit of grip to get underneath and maybe crack that up. So just little by little, I don't want to saw into the fretboard. No, I do not. I'm wearing my glasses, so uh, make sure for stuff like this, wear eye protection of some sort. There we go. And that's a way. Use this to clean it up. And I'll keep doing this all the way down, <clears throat> just gentling it until I get this entire hunk of wood off. Then, or there may be the option of leaving this hunk of wood on here, um, depending on what banjo body I, can, I hook this up to, so that I have something a little thicker right there. Um, most banjos and uh, and mandolin banjos the fretboard goes over the uh, the body of the instrument and if I don't have something on there to allow for uh, for reaching down here and pushing I could you can see, you see how much flex there is I could actually do some damage so Something that I'll have to consider when I go mating and matching this uh, banjo neck up, or this mandolin neck up to a banjo body. So far, I haven't found a banjo body that I can use this on. Um, uh, I don't have my tape measure here, so I can't tell you how long this dowel is. I should probably uh, measure all the dowels and uh, write on them. How, uh, how long they are. But for now, I'm just gonna blue tape this, uh, this piece to the neck, this fingerboard to the neck, and that way I keep them together. Here you can see how the fingerboard and the, the neck itself don't exactly match up. So who knows? Uh, there's a chance this fingerboard won't get used on this neck at all. <laughs> Everything's a work in progress.